Welcome everyone to HFN, also known as HFN News, where we trade different. Today is November the 5th, 2020, and not only do we trade different here on this channel, we also give you all a heads up as to where the trap. He's the one you guys see on the left side of my screen, on the bottom. He's the criminal. He's the one that's trying to take the money from us. So we follow what he does and make sure that we try to get a position on where he's going in the future so we can take back the bag. All right. So if this is your first time watching our video, you guys appreciate the simplicity and the not the excitement, not the fun, not the FOMO. Then make sure before you go, hit the like button, subscribe to the channel. Now, XRP is the video that we are going to talk about today. Uh, the last time we did our video in XRP was on the first day of November 2020. You guys can see right here. This is the performance of the trap. You guys can already tell we established a trading range that the trap was going to hold which is 26 cents all the way back down to 23 so for the last four days for the last five days the market the trap he hasn't done too much he is still maintaining that price right in between that consolidation area we identified it's not a surprise we saw that all the way back on the first of november we did as well on the first day of november said that we would TP the market for XRP all the way back down here at 23 cents. November 3rd is where the trap came in and tagged out our area. We told you all that. So in three days, the trap came and touched our area of support or the location that we said we would TP out. So 4.06% right there. It's done and it's over. Now, let's refresh the screen and let's see what he's planning on doing now going forward into the future. So the market is calm for XRP in relation to where we are trading at within this consolidation range. The trap is not eager to pursue price movement outside of this area yet. So we got time to actually see what he plans on doing. And the only way that you'll be able to determine that is looking at the market further out. So let's look at this particular market in XRP on a two day time frame. What do you see here? Do you see anything different that would suggest that the trap is about to make an impending move? What about on a three day chart? What are you seeing here? Do you still see weakness? Do you still do you see strength? All right, let's look at it on five day. What do you see on the market on the five day chart for XRP? Because I'll be the first one to tell you that there's nothing here in the market that could substantiate higher price. Now, yet the only thing that is propping up this particular market is that support area at 23 cents. If we see the trap break that to the downside, which is still in forecast, we're coming all the way back down to at least 22 cents. And that's in the long term. OK, this is the only thing. There's nothing else on this chart that is propping up the trap from actually breaking down the price level of XRP. This goes, it all goes. And don't forget on our prior videos for XRP, we created a downtrend and the market in XRP is still following that method and is still following that way. So it's not a lot here for those who are eager to see XRP go higher. This is not the environment right now. But it gives you opportunity because it hasn't broken that support area yet, 23 cents. So you still got a little bit of life in you for those who are holding hope to see XRP go higher. But right now, on these multiple time frames, we have to continue to go on with the trend. Now, the trend, look at the weekly time frame. We had all of these weeks that the market in XRP hasn't done anything nothing when the trap gets tired you'll see a massive swoop down in price that would be detrimental for those who are looking for xrp to go higher i'm just saying so we have to be careful get in position so when you do a risk adjusted basis or position yeah there is some risk for those who are looking for XRP to go lower, because the risk would be 
I would say 30%, 70%, 30% that the market trap will hold this line, 23 cents and move higher. 70% that the market is still weak. Okay. And one of the crazy things about this is that Bitcoin paired against the dollar is showing you monument, monumental strength right now. Let me show you. This is Bitcoin right here. Paired against the dollar, Bitcoin is definitely making massive gains. For some reason, XRP is not. Ask yourself the question why? Because it always goes back to interest and demand. More people are eager to get their hands on Bitcoin than they are with XRP. It is what it is. There's no confusion about it. Okay. So we got to take that into consideration. It doesn't mean that XRP is a bad business. I mean that Ripple is a bad business. It just simply means that doesn't nobody wants to hold it right now. And until we get that demand shift to where more people are eager to hold XRP, then we'll see this value of XRP increase. But until that time, that's why the market has just been consolidated for the last couple of weeks. It's trying to drum up some demand. And if we cannot drum up enough demand to pursue higher price in this range, then best believe we're going to continue to go lower in price. All right. So this video. What do you all expect the market trap to do? Higher, lower price, or are we just going to hold this range? Because for us, we're going to sideline our forecast on this one. We need to wait and see a little bit more information as to whether or not we're going to continue to go lower. Now, the long term, I'm leaning weakness. OK, I'm telling you that now for the long term in XRP, I'm definitely looking for the trap to go lower. But playing this on the daily time frame, we're going to wait. OK, and since we're waiting, I want you to tell me what do you think the market trap is going to do for XRP in the next three days? Where will the price be? Because in the next three days, I'm not really seeing a lot of price movement occurring in XRP, which gives us another opportunity to put in a different forecast when that time comes. So tell me, what do you see? Let me know about XRP. Are, are we going to continue to trade in this range? What's your position? Tell me your TP price. And again, don't make this complicated. It's too much information already out there that is confusing so many people. We're not about that life. So tell us something simple. Make sure you maintain a profitability and trade different.